Welcome to your free video lesson from Teach You Comp Incorporated. Be sure to check out your exclusive discount offer at the end of your free lesson. Another way of adding paragraph indentation is to use the four indentation markers that are provided on the horizontal ruler. So first you have to make sure your ruler is displayed. If it's not, you can choose to display it by making sure that you select View and Ruler to turn it on. Now these markers are the left indent, which is the one that's the small square on the bottom. The first line indent, which is the one that points downward, looks kind of like a home plate. Hanging indent, which is the one that points upward looking like a home plate. And the one that's far at the right end looks like hanging indent, but is actually the entire right indent. And so you can drag the indent markers in to indent the paragraph as needed. Either a first line, hanging, which is used for bibliographies, or the left and right. Note that you could also set different indentations for different paragraphs. Just make sure you've selected or clicked into the paragraph on which you'd like to set the formatting of the paragraph and its indentation before making changes to the indentation marks located in the ruler. Thank you. We hope you enjoyed your free video lesson from Teach You Comp Incorporated. Like what you see? Pick up your copy of our complete tutorial today and be sure to visit us at www.teachucomp.com slash YouTube for your special bonus offer. Our complete tutorial featuring introductory through advanced material is available on CD-ROM or digital download. You will receive our high quality video lessons plus printable instruction manuals in one easy to use training package. With over two dozen titles to choose from, you'll be sure to find the training you need in Microsoft Office, QuickBooks, Photoshop, and much more. Visit us today!